alternating current. The frequency of an alternating current is the number of complete cycles or alternations produced by the alternating current source in one second. The unit of frequency is the hertz. One hertz is equal to one cycle per second. The time for the alternating current to make one complete cycle is known as its period T. Thus, the relationship between F and T is given by the following equation. For example, in Malaysia, common house electrical supply is at 50 Hz. This means that the current changes direction 100 times, or 50 cycles in one second. In discussing alternating current and voltage, it is necessary to express the current and voltage in terms of maximum or peak values, effective values. Each of these values has a different meaning, and is used to describe a different amount of current or voltage. Effective value of an alternating current, is called as root mean square value. The root mean square value, is the current or voltage of alternating current, that can produce the same heating effect in a conductor, as that of a direct current of the same value. Consider the two circuits shown below, P and Q, that are lit by a direct current and alternating current source respectively. If the voltage of the direct current is 2 volts, and the root mean square value of the alternating current is also 2 volts, both the lamps are of the same brightness. This is because, the root mean square voltage of the alternating current, is equal in the value to the voltage of the direct current. The root mean square value of alternating current will have the same effect on the bulb as a comparable value of direct current will have on the same bulb. The peak value of an alternating current is the maximum value of the alternating current. The values of alternating current increases from zero to its maximum value and then decreases to zero again before it alternates. The following equation shows the relationship between the root mean square value and its peak value. The root mean square values of voltage and current represent the effective value of the voltage and current in an AC circuit. Thank you for taking time to watch this.